Hi, Tim Merva here for Studio 902 Web Solutions, and today we're going to talk about the difference between a domain name and a URL. And we're going to use a fictitious company called Energy5 as our example. Now, Energy5 is the domain name, and that's only part of the URL. The domain name is broad and could be included in many different URLs, so it's not at all specific. It gets you into the right neighborhood, but not to a specific resource on the internet. It's kind of like going to a specific street, but not knowing what house number to go to. However, a URL is a uniform resource locator. That's a uniform way to locate a specific resource on the internet. By nature, it's very narrow and extremely specific and exclusive. Now, the uniform resource locator, otherwise known as the web address, it locates a specific resource on the web in much the same manner that the street address helps you locate a specific location uh, such as a home or business in the physical world. Now the anatomy of a URL is like this. It begins with the machine name or subdomain followed by the domain name followed by the domain extension or top-level domain. Now there are many top-level domains including .com, .net, .org, and many others. Various top-level domains will take you to different kinds of content or resources on the web within the same domain. For example, energy5.com could be the company's main website and energy5.net might be their solar panel sales division. Energy5.info could be their political action and advocacy site whereas energy5.co could simply be a redirect back to their .com. So if this were your company and you registered multiple top-level domains under your domain name, then each top-level domain could have its own website with its own uniquely different content, all under the same brand of Energy5. Now there's a lot of other reasons for registering multiple top-level domains but that's a subject for a different video at a different time. You could also achieve the same objective to access different resources on a single website by just changing the page name. For instance, energy5.com forward slash index would be the company's main page. energy5.com forward slash buy dash solar could be the company's solar panel sales page. And energy5.com forward slash political dash action could be the website's political action page. This is all within the same website and these are all still unique URLs for different content but it's just different pages within your domain. So what we've seen is while they are incorrectly frequently interchanged a domain name is only part of the URL and so therefore the URL and the domain name are not the same thing. I hope this video has been helpful to you Please go to studio902.net to register your own unique domain name and begin to build your web presence today.